Whoa, did we like it? Oh, are we ever going on a cruise again? Wow. Hey, good morning. Good morning. From the middle of the ocean. What better thing to do in the middle of the ocean than play some mini golf? It's a good start to the day. Also, happy Thanksgiving. We're gonna have Thanksgiving on a cruise ship. And this is what the day is gonna be. So, so far, Jessica's got two hole-in-ones. Uh, there's no proof, but I did. But there's no proof, so now we have to film everything. No, nope, that one's not gonna be it. Anyways, let's try, let's give it a shot here. Dang it. It's pretty loud over here, because this is the smokestack thingy. It's giant, I don't know what you call it. It's pretty big and noisy. But once you're done, you put uh, these Duma hickeys back in here. We call that a match complete. Anyways, to get out of here, we gotta go through these sports courts. Oh, another shack. He's 7-1. Really Happy Thanksgiving. We're actually alone in this Skybox sports bar. Such as heart disease. There. And we're going to watch the, the Macy's Day Parade. Right on these big old screens here. Don't wait. For more food, we're at the Golden Olympian. Olympian restaurant? Yes. Yeah, for them fancy lights up there and all the gold, golden everywhere. This is the last night. This is it. We're on our way out there, on our way back to the US of A. But first, we feast. Yes. And of course, we have to start with appetizers, right? Mm -hmm. And you got the cauliflower and something kind of cheese that I can't pronounce soup. Gruyere. I don't know if that's how you say it, but that's how I say it. And I got the something and oh, cauliflower and focaccia. Oh, what's that? Something's happening. I don't really know what's happening. And since it is Thanksgiving Day, hey, happy Thanksgiving. Oh, we got the, the turkey. I got a red blinking light, so we gotta be fast. Turkey and stuff and stuff and stuff and stuff. <laughs> Perfect. And I got the Thanksgiving pork chop. Pork chop. Oh yeah, it's gonna be so good. And a pork or a pork chop potato? No, a Thanksgiving potato. Oh yeah, that's gonna be real good too. Okay. Uh, blinking light. And look, it's special. It's special dessert for uh, Thanksgiving. Look, you got pecan pie. I got pecan pie. It's pecan pie. I got the classic pumpkin pie with three dots of something. But yeah, pretty stoked for that. So that's gonna be delicious. And that's the, it's really blinking red now. So anyways, that's that. There we go. A Arrivederci. Au revoir. So long and ciao. That's us on our cruise trip. First cruise, I'm backing up. Yeah, it was pretty good, wouldn't you say? Totally. Totally. Uh, quick thoughts on the cruise in general. One thing, we were scared that the motion was gonna get to us, and I don't, I don't think it did. I don't know if it's just because of the cruise or the, the route that we went on or the weather. The night leaving was kind of rough and actually, now that I say that, like tonight, we're heading back into port, into Port Canaveral. It, you can feel it, like, you, you can't see it, but you can feel it, I can feel it. I got this cool shirt in the Bahamas, so we did that. I never thought I would do that. It's neat to do things that you don't think you're gonna do and just do them. Listen, we didn't go on a cruise ever because Jessica was scared of the Kraken because it was gonna eat our ship. And I think I've said this before, but it, could still be out there. It could still happen. We're not back safe into port yet. What? Seven or eight hours. We still have like seven or eight hours on the water until we're back to where the thing is. So the room was really nice. I enjoyed having the balcony. Um, the balcony was really nice. It had awesome views in the morning and the, in the evenings. Right now, you know what? Let's just go out there real quick. 
right now it's not going to be much of a view because it's dark out right okay so yeah not much right there you can just see the the water down there doing its thing it does sound cool it's like waves at the at the beach or whatever it's like relaxing and there's the there's the thing where the people pilot in this thing that's where they are it's kind of cool but yeah you can't see too much going on out here right now stars though definitely a star it's kind of cool all right let's go back inside there's really not much not much to see out here but ooh, the doors are heavy and one thing uh steps everywhere so like in all the doors um you have steps i guess that's just in case of like water coming in or whatever oh but anyways um if you hear a little bit of racket jessica is actually getting some stuff together so that way in the morning we can just grab our luggage and just head on out we were kind of talking about this earlier and one of the things that we think really makes a cruise kind of amazing is the uh it's the crew they're so nice they remember your name they remember things you like they remember things about you it's kind of incredible especially when you think about like that they are working like just about 24 7 seven days a week yeah that's what i mean like they're 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 working away from their families non-stop they don't have days off when their shift is done they get to sleep and do laundry or whatever then get right back up and serve people you know we ate uh all the restaurants we went to some ports we went to the what nassau bahamas we went there we went to princess k we'll probably make like a playlist where it's like hey first cruise uh you know adventure experience whoa did we like it oh are we ever going on a cruise again wow yeah we probably will gotta say we enjoyed it thank you carnival liberty crew for making this a, a great first experience and um we'll see you guys in the next one as far as we're concerned yeah that's pretty cool